bringing the people behind our food to life. So today we're making some bone marrow and smoked cherry ice cream. We're working with just marrow bones that you can get really at any butcher. Uh, and we're just going to blanch them real quick just to loosen up the marrow in them. Without bees, um, there would be no cherries. And without the honeybees that we use that are provided to us by migratory beekeepers, there'd be far less cherries here than, uh, uh, than what we have now. As far as the future, I, I think that the biggest challenge that, that we have in farming has to do with, with our supply of labor. 